Hello Internet and welcome to my channel. So recently I bought Red Dead Redemption 2 on Steam. It was on sale, but I tried to install it and run it. I faced a very unique problem. The game will start to launch, but it will fail to launch. It will just disappear without any error. So if you are in the same situation, watch this video till the end. This solution worked for me and hopefully it will work for you as well. I will just fast forward it a little bit just to show you what happens when I was trying to launch the game. The launcher will load perfectly. It will stay that way for a few seconds, probably a minute, and then it will just close, shut down without any error at all. So essentially the game was failing to launch. As you can see, the task manager, no sign of the game. I tried different techniques, different solutions are available. One was registry edit. I tried that some users recommend uninstalling OBS. I didn't try that, but this solution worked for me. It's very simple. Go to documents folder, find the Rockstar games folder. Here you have to go to RDR2 folder and you should see here a folder called system. Oh, sorry, settings. If you don't see it, you can create one. Create a folder named settings. Inside this folder, we will create a text file with the name system. So just click the new text file, call it system. We will have to change the extension later, but that bit we can do it afterward. Then you have to go into on this web page, rdr2.forceflow.de. I will leave the link in the description. So once you will go into this web page you will see this window two panels completely empty so on the right panel on the left panel click load example here select all the text copy it and now you can open your system.txt file and paste all the text here in this file we need to make two minor modifications the first one at the bottom of the file you can see the graphic card name my graphic card is 2050 so i will select this and change it with 2050. The second change is up in the file. Here you have to look for a text called API K settings API Vulkan. Instead of Vulkan, type DX12. That's all. We can save this file and close it. Now you have to change the extension. It's very simple. Just click rename and instead of TXT, type XML. If you can't find this option, look in the view folder, uh, view menu, and select show extensions. So now these two steps are sort of optional. I run the Steam as administrator. Wait for the Steam to load. And once the Steam is loaded, I also run the Rockstar Game Launcher as administrator. I'm not sure if it is 100% required or not, but I didn't want to take any chances. You're more than welcome to try. So once those two launchers are loaded, I just try to run the game again. I will fast forward it a little bit because it takes a couple of minutes maybe to load the game. There you go, so the game can finally load. And those who are subscribers to my channel, you will know that there will be soon a video for showing the performance of this game on my laptop. So please do subscribe if you want to see how it performs on 2050. I will change the settings later. Let me just run the game just to show that it really works. In the story mode so it will start loading now i hope this video will help you if it did please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching